Besides running into a uh, red hot goaltender again, uh, you got to be pretty pleased with your the effort of your hockey club. Uh, it was it was amazing how we came at them. You know, first period was terrific. We put up a uh, 15, 16 shots. Third period, we shot them 19 to five. Um, supported the puck very, very well, and you know, the only time they really got anything going was on the power play. So, you know, we learned from it. I feel bad for Mike Matheson. He played a great game for us, and you know, it was unfortunate. Just an unlucky bounce it wasn't his fault, but hey, he got a point, and a lot of good stuff happening. And UC Jokin and finally rewarded uh, seven, eight games without a point, and he gets a big uh, game time goal. Yeah, no, UC's a pro, and you know, it's just a matter of time before he gets on the score sheet. So I was happy for him. You know, we, we did, a, like I said, we did a lot. Of good stuff tonight. I mean, I told the guys after the game, I said, as frustrating as it is and as mad as some of you may be, there's too many positives here to get down. So let's, you know, build, keep building on what we've started. And it started before the game with Keith Yandel able to go, and uh, he really played a solid game. Yeah, he played unbelievable. And I mean, last night I thought he'd be out for a couple of weeks, and but that shows you how tough he is mentally and physically. And he, you know, they come in, they do some treatment. Our trainers deserve a lot of credit for getting them ready. You know, Dave DiNapoli and Tim Whitner and Tommy Alva. I mean, that's a phenomenal medical staff and they had him in the lineup and he was a big help and that's inspirational isn't it yeah it really is I mean it's great for the young kids to see that in a game where he could have mailed it in easily and nobody would have said a word but he this guy teammate he is you know he's a great guy and the top what? line see the gel with Smitty over there Barky yeah, yeah. And the chances and a goal no I think it's great because uh, Smitty's really playing well and then Barky and Yag's obviously a great hockey player so it's a good real good combination Trocek's line starting to really get going too so it's yeah, I think we're getting some pretty good balance what is it with this hockey club that really starts to turn it up in the third period yeah uh, you know what conditioning number one they're well conditioned athletes and you know that we just said just stay with the plan you know don't don't get frustrated because the pucks aren't going in just keep you know supporting the puck real strong like they did throughout the game and then that's that's what we got to continue to do every night T sum up your, your feelings after a very emotionally draining trip and also a pretty tough resilient group out there yeah you know hey, we're moving on we're moving forward it's a great group of guys great uh, great players are a lot of fun to coach and we have a lot of a lot of great days ahead of us